I think one of the most important parts, I think, is just to make sure that um, if, for instance, in Exeter, I think, like, would like you can see here, also the flood defence is really important because um, actually, you know, that has. I've had obviously a lot of problems obviously in Devon with floods and where sort of drains have been blocked for instance and um, obviously they've had to shut roads as a result so I think as long as they focus on investing in being able to have those roads open as you know as soon as possible after these floods and things like that that would be great because uh, as a driver that does 3,000 miles a week which I do and um, that would be obviously <laughs> something important to me to be able to get home on time and things like that. So. I think maybe South Water could give us cheaper bills. <laughs> For me in general it's actually just, it's just education, like it, if you educate people earlier on about where, just waste management in general, it's not just water but like everything, then we can start kind of looking after the planet that we have, because we're, we're overpopulating, we will, it will continue, um, it's just a case of kind of trying to curtail all the issues that will turn up and try and solve issues as they're coming up as well. So. As long as I continue to have good clean drinking water uh, readily available, then I shall continue to be happy. Well I would think uh, one of the key things Southwest Water should do is obviously that uh, the quality of the water <coughs> is maintained as the highest possible quality. Uh, I think it's a public resource so we should be looking after it. Uh, I don't think we should be paying the earth for it but I think we should expect to uh, face some expense in making sure the quality is maintained. <laughs>